I just need you to shut up with these accusations you're making about Ivy. So you're going to risk our friendship over her? Look, it's not something I want to do. But I can't have you attacking her like this. Sam, she's a liar and she's a manipulator. Look, I told you not to talk about the mother of my son like that. Oh, yeah, Ethan, the son that you never knew you had until he was grown up because Ivy pretended that it was Julian's son? Sam, she lied to you. She used you. Then she dumped you to marry the Crane Millions. Why the hell are you being so blind? I'm not. Look, I know Ivy is not without fault. But she only married Julian because her father and Alistair Crane made a business deal, okay? And she was part of it. Do you see me? She was young. She was naive. And her father made her believe that Julian loved her and that I dumped her. Damn it, Sam, she is a gold digger. She was the governor's daughter. She didn't give a damn about the money. All right, Sam, if she loved you so much, then why didn't she marry after she was pregnant with Ethan? Because she was afraid of her father. Afraid of Alistair. She didn't even know she was pregnant till she, till she went back to, to Julian out of fear. Sam, I can't believe that you're being so blindsided by this. All right, Louise had the CDs. CDs that prove that, that the Cranes did horrible things to the people in this town. How they used them, how he manipulated everybody. And I bet my life on it. I bet you that there was something on those CDs that was negative about Ivy. You don't know that. Oh, yeah, you're right. You know what? I don't know that, okay? But I wish I could have seen what was on those discs. So it would have opened your eyes to the schemes that Ivy has. I told you to stop talking about her like that. Sam. Damn it, Sam. You know that it's true. I know I love her. You love her. And I won't have you bad-mouthing her like that. How would you feel if I talked about Eve like that? You know what? Eve is not a conniving, two-timing bitch like Ivy. Oh, my God! Oh, oh. Jay, are you crazy? What, what are you doing? doing? Stop! What are you doing? Are you damn? Stop it! What do you are you fighting about? You guys have been friends forever. What could possibly make you come to blows? What is going on in here? Go ahead, Sam. Tell him. Tell him what we're fighting about. Well, is somebody going to tell us what happened? Why are you fighting? Will you please explain this, Sam? Let her go, Ivy. No. No, Sam, I'll tell him. Ivy, my wife and I, we don't like you. T.C., shut your mouth. No, I'm not going to shut my mouth. Should have said this a long time ago. We resent the way you just moved in here. Grace wasn't even gone five minutes, and you just swooped in trying to be the lady of the house. Grace abandoned Sam, if you remember. She's off in Europe with her first husband, and I didn't just swoop in here like a vulture. I, I've been staying here trying to help him take care of the house and the children and his grandchild. Oh, yeah, yeah, right. You're, you're trying to help, all right? You're trying to help yourself to Sam. That's what you're trying to do. T.C., don't do this. No, Sam, you, I can't believe that she's doing this to you. This woman has you so duped. She tells you anything, and you just believe her lies. Listen, shut your mouth, or I'll deck you this time, and I mean it. Yeah, come on. Come on. See, honey, that's what we were fighting about. Oh, Sam. You were defending me? Uh, oh, Sam. See, that's what I'm talking about. Playing this whole helpless role here. You, yeah, you snake. Honey, please, this, this is not the time, okay? And this is none of your damn business. You know what? When my best friend is being made a fool of, I make it my business. How am I being made a fool? I just feel it in my gut, all right? Ivy orchestrated this whole thing. I think Rebecca was right. I think you somehow, some way, got David to come back to Harmony. Grace's long-lost husband. Give me a break. That's ridiculous. T.C., you know, we already went over all of this when David came back to town. He had a legitimate marriage license, and... The DNA test showed that John was Grace and David's son. Sweetheart, something's going on here. Something's not right. Something is very fishy here. There is nothing fishy about this. You know what, Ivy? For someone who doesn't have anything to hide, you sure do protest a lot. <gasps> Chief Bennett. Oh, I'm so glad you're there. Charity... What's going on? You have to come to the hospital. It's Kay. Kay? What's wrong? 
Huh? What happened? She's been hurt. There's been an accident. I think you should come as quickly as you can. I'm on my way. That was the emergency room. They need me at the hospital. That's Kay. Charity just called to tell me. What happened? Is she all right? I, I don't know. Look, I'll come with you. Okay. I I I'll go, too. I no, no, no. Look, stay here, okay? Jessica's upstairs sleeping. All right. Uh, sure, of course. Okay. Of course. Yeah, I'll be back. I'll let you know what's going on. Yeah, sweetheart, I'll be at home. Just, just let me know how she's doing. Okay. This ain't over, Ivy. Kate Bennett was brought in. Where is she? She's in one. Thank you. No, Eve, Sam, Eve, Sam. Eve, no way. I gotta see my daughter. Sam, wait. Okay. Oh my God. Okay, Sam, no. You, you wait outside, Sam. I will let you know when I assess her condition. Out, Sam, out. I'll let you know.